Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Pie Day. That's right, Pie Day. It's not that we're having pie for lunch or breakfast this morning, but it's Pie Day. And pie is a mathematical number. You can probably ask your teacher about it. It's a very uh, unique number, a very interesting number. It's spelled P-I. It's a Greek, actually a Greek letter. And the number pi is a ratio between the circumference and the diameter of a circle. And that number, which begins with the integer 3, and then decimal numbers after that is 3.14. So today is 3.14, if you put the date as a decimal number, March the 14th. So March the 14th is always Pi Day. Now one of the interesting things about Pi is that the ratio of the circumference to the diameter of a circle never ends. It's an unending number, which is hard for, to, for us to wrap our brains around. But if you compute the ratio of the circumference to the diameter of a circle and keep calculating and calculating, the numbers never end and they never repeat. Mathematicians have calculated the number pi out to a trillion decimal points, places, a trillion decimal places. That's a lot. <laughs> So, but the first numbers are 3.14. So today is Pi Day. Maybe your teachers will have something special for Pi Day or can tell you a little bit more about that. Pi Day. And Albert Einstein's birthday is today. So he's one of the greatest mathematicians of all time, and his birthday is on Pi Day, March the 14th. Okay. Well, for breakfast, or excuse me, for lunch, it's not pie, but here's what we have. For uh, lunch today, we have choice A, chicken noodle soup. Choice A is chicken noodle soup, and choice B is chili. So chicken noodle soup A, chili B. Everybody gets a half a sandwich, some graham crackers, and some fresh fruit. Well, we have birthday people with us here today, but before that, I will mention that um, the talent show is tomorrow, 6 o'clock on Friday here in the gym, so we have that going on. And uh, Monday, we begin some practice for the iRead 3 test. And on Tuesday, we'll be taking the iRead 3, another, isn't it marvelous, state test for our students to take, the iRead 3. We'll do our best to teach a few things in between all the testing. All right, so let's get to birthday people. All right, let me switch the camera. <clears throat> Here they come. Okay, we have one with us today who's here. Why don't you... All right, now, it's not your birthday, is it? Well, tell everybody your first name. Kaya. Hi, Kaya. You're here to talk about a special birthday, though. Who, who are you here for? Miss Clark. Miss Clark's birthday is today? You think she's like 74 or something? No, not 74. Okay, you want to wish her a happy birthday? Happy birthday. Okay, so all of us wish her a birthday. Give her a wave. So you're here for representing all of Miss Clark's students. All right, thank you. Have a seat. It's nice of you to come down. <clears throat> we appreciate that. So happy birthday to our third grade teacher, Mrs. Clark, in the third grade. And Kai was here to help celebrate that. Now let's bring up, we have four students with birthdays today. So let's bring them back. I think let's start with the back row. Let's start with our guys in the back. Come on up, one at a time. Okay, we'll put it over here. You can kind of see yourself. Oh, oh uh, there you are. All right, so tell everybody your first name. Nolan. Nolan, happy birthday. That's an unusual di uh, design on your shirt. Those yeah. are like eyes, aren't they? Yeah. It's the C, oh, the teeth down there. Very unusual. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Who's your teacher? Um, Softman. Softman, so you're in the fourth grade. How old are you? Ten. Ten. Happy birthday to you in your decade. Do you want to shout out to anyone? Um, ben. Holden, Trey, Isaac, Gavin, Graham, Nicholas, and Dylan. All right, sounds pretty good to me. Wave, give them a wave. Uh, rocks. <laughs> okay, come on up. Here's birth, birthday student number two. Hi, right, tell everybody your first name. Devin. Hi, right, Devin. Who's your teacher? Miss Ubish. All right, so you're in the fifth grade. How old are you? Eleven. Eleven. That makes sense to me. You want to shout out to anyone? Zach and Josh. Zach and Josh. Does Miss Rubish rock? 
Okay, I think so too. Happy birthday to you. One decade plus a year makes you 11. I have some birthday pencils for you. So have a seat back there. Now we're going to bring up our two young ladies. Young ladies over here. We've got two young ladies, but one of them's already been up. So here we go. There you are. All right. Hi. Happy birthday. Who's, what's your first name? Bailey. Bailey. Who's your teacher? Miss Denton. Miss Denton. You're a fifth grader too. Are you 11? Yeah. Oh, 11. That's a good age. Decade plus one. Do you want to shout out to anyone? Uh, Chloe, Elena, Taylor, Riley, Adley, Sydney. That's a list. Good job for you. Happy birthday. I'll have birthday pencils for you in a minute. Number four, come on up. You've been waiting patiently. Tell everybody your first name. Donovan. Hi, Donovan. I like that shirt, too. It's very nice, very pretty red. Uh, who's your teacher? Miss Anderson. Miss Anderson. So you are a second grader. You're not 73 either, are you? No. No, how old are you? Eight. Yeah, eight. Eight. Uh, eight years old now. Happy birthday to you, Donovan. Do you want to shout out to anyone? shout out to my whole class. Your whole class. Silas okay. and Jack. That's great. Does Mrs. Anderson rock? Yes. Why don't you wave everybody? Give them a shot. Wave. Okay. Have a seat back there. <clears throat> I'm going to leave everybody sitting so I can get you on camera. Hold those, and, but don't cover up your faces. I think if you stay seated, I can get everybody. So out there, if you would get ready for a Pledge of Allegiance moment of silence and our We Care promise, it would be great. Here we go. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Moment of silence. And her we care promise. I promise to hurt no one in word or action today. I use my hands for helping. I use my words for kindness. I include everyone. One, one, three will say happy Pi Day. One, two, three. Happy, happy Pi Day. day. <laughs> okay. Give them one last wave. <laughs> oh my. 3.14. Interesting number. Goes on and on. I think we're finished here. Work hard today. Uh, fifth graders, remember what we talked about with Officer Cordy in the afternoon. Great behavior today from everybody. Okay, we'll see you in the hallways. Bye-bye. That's it.